Uh, my take on this illegal immigration catastrophe. Look, at former President Donald Trump sent out today a Make America Great Again circular, and it was entitled, Biden has done all he can to open the border. Mr. Trump argues that Biden terminated his successful Remain in Mexico policy. Biden signed an executive order on his first day in office to halt the construction of the border wall. Biden reinstated catch and release. Biden ordered ICE to stop worksite immigration enforcement. And Biden stopped deporting illegal immigrants who were in the country illegally. Plus, I would add, Title 42 was ended, and that was a pandemic health check of great importance. Now, as we know, the three-year Biden number is roughly 8 million illegals with all the sex and drug trafficking, fentanyl killing, law and order disrupting that goes along with this disaster. The House has passed H.R. 2, which is a superb bill that would essentially restore the Trump approach, build the wall, remain in Mexico, catch and deport. The Senate is now crafting a bill. Now, we don't know all the details because so far there's no legislative text. But various Senate leaks have been talking about something called a trigger authorization. This is a very bad idea. This trigger would allegedly curb immigration if 8,500 illegals arrive at the border in one day or 5,000 illegals arrive for seven days in a row. Now, for context, in December, the dailies averaged nearly 10,000. So I don't believe for one minute that President Biden or DHS Secretary Mayorkas will close the border. Whether it's 5,000 or 8,500, that is way too high anyway. House Speaker Mike Johnson calls for a policy of zero tolerance. He is right. And if Mr. Biden and the senators believe they can close the border after 5,000 or 8,500 arrive daily, then how about just closing the border? Period. Full stop. End of sentence. Just close it. What we know about the Senate bill is it will continue the parole problem, continue the asylum problem, is loaded with loopholes, and it will not end the Biden open border policy of catch and release. Migrants will not be detained, will not be sent home as they await asylum decisions, and there is no remain in Mexico, and there's no help from a Mexican military presence of about 25,000 troops such as Mr. Trump got through his negotiation. And there is no wall in the Senate bill, and there is no Title 42 in the Senate bill. From what we know, the bill in the Senate is a very bad idea. And Mr. Trump and the House GOP, and hopefully a majority of Republican senators, should definitely oppose it. And that's my riff.